Hello, 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 and welcome to another episode of a Crazy Town Gaming. My name is Jonas, I'm your host, and I'm here with TNT Dynamite Dance Sports. Well, Jonas, you're the man on the stage. Dude, I am. Playing that Madden 21. We're playing the Washington football team. It's gonna get real up in here. Dude, we're football team and like a football team would do. You better recognize true football players when you see them. Yeah, they won their first game as a football team, though. They, they did. Yeah, they were losing and they came back at the end and won. And their coach has cancer and like they gave him the game ball. It was very like a uh, yeah. very momentous day. The first, the first game after they got rid of their racial undertoned team name. <laughs> They're victorious. They came back. They overcame and won. So, okay, look, Joe, let's, let's get into some real stuff then here real quick. All right. All right, because, you know, it, it is it is something kind of controversial about how they, how they changed their name. They obviously did it under duress. They were definitely pressured. They were pressured. Because the they owner made had a fought for a long time to not change it. Yeah, they made a statement saying that they were never going to do it. And now they're doing it. Um, yeah. They also have made a statement, Jonas, that they they plan they may they may keep the name just Washington Football I Team. I flip and hope they do. Everybody loves it. That's the thing. Everybody loves it. The the gears and the merch is actually selling better oh, for I'm them. Oh, sure, dude. If prior dude, to when they were, if the, I that name that should not be mentioned, <laughs> dude. I like in their new uniforms, just with the numbers on the helmet, that they're the only team that has numbers. Like the Browns have an all orange helmet, so I wouldn't want them to be just all. Uh, I haven't watched them actually play. Is that what they actually Yeah, look they like? put, yeah, they have the numbers on the side. Okay. Well, dude, I would like the big W too. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Just something basic. And I don't know what it is about that that I like so much, yeah. but I really do, dude. I like have always hated like the R skins, but like. <laughs> it's because they, it's because they have good colors, I think. Yeah, dude, I think it's just a nice little like. Yeah, uh, it's nice. I would, I would be, I would be more of a fan of them if they kept it Washington football team. Yeah, yeah, I like it better. Yeah, dude. I do. So, so, like, do we have to like purge the uh, the moniker out of our out of our vocabulary? Dude, can they change Cleveland to the Cleveland baseball team? Because I would probably support that. Yeah, right. You're not even wrong. <laughs> like, what? No, look at it. I like, think we talked about this in the last so Redskins true. video, and I, I don't know if we we may be uh, hypocritical right now, but I feel oh, like dude. if they changed it to like the, the Cleveland baseball team, I would be, like, dude, I would love it. Not wrong. Cleveland Indians is a little crazy. Um, and you know they did get rid of Wahoo, but yeah, yeah, Cleveland Indians is a little crazy. I wouldn't be surprised they were thinking about it as like, well, the though. Indians is probably a little less offensive than the R skins. Oh yeah. Yeah. But like, <laughs> but I could still see it being like. <laughs> I, I think, yeah, I think, I think purging the old name is probably a good idea, and I do think that the Indians can change. And honestly, it's only going to sell. One, like the success that they are seeing from from sales just being the Washington football scene. If Cleveland was to get something similar going that'd be great for the city yeah and yeah. I'm, I'm sorry i'm from cleveland all right i'm well they still beating have, my chest and they still have one. the chiefs under kansas city but is that one not as offensive because it's like a uh it's it's, it's like a you know a chief is like a high-ranking official in the culture what <laughs> What? I mean, I don't know. Chief is just a you, word. I've never heard anyone say. It, okay, chief is a word. The only time that you could misconstrue chief for being like a little bit insensitive is when they put the arrowhead next to it. But that's the whole team logo has the arrowhead on it. Okay, well, they don't always put it on everything. Yeah, it, the logo <laughs> is an arrowhead with KC in it. They're probably thinking about it, too. Okay, look. But Jonas. I've never heard any pressure about that one. No, I know it either. Because I guess it's not. I don't understand why every team has to be an animal, a race of people, <laughs> or like a, a mythical creature. Yeah, what are they going? What are they going to be like? The Washington businessmen? Cause I don't know, but why couldn't it be like a? I don't know the Washington beards. The can, beards, can dude. Make it the, the Cleveland. I don't know, dude. I don't know why team names always have to be yeah, rec like recognize. Uh, I guess it's hard to name something unless you kind of like. Because now that you think about it, all teams are just that. 
Right. Yeah, dude, they're just, I mean, it's, yeah. There's like, I mean, like, some of them are like, uh, South Carolina's the Gamecocks, but I guess that's an animal, that's too. That's an animal. I mean, Browns, Steelers, I Browns guess. Browns was like based on the guy who created it. Yeah, so that, that's, that's just like strong respect. Yeah, Steelers I, I kinda is like from that. the steel city of Pittsburgh because they're a steel town. Yeah, but it doesn't really make any sense. It's just, we've accepted it at this point, yeah, but I'm it never really makes sense. there's any other teams that like, that like debunk the... No, they're always like animals or... UNLV running rebels. Race of people. <laughs> rebels? <laughs> yes. Um, let's see. Why does it have to be? I don't know. It just seems like it's always pe people, mythical creature, animals. Yeah, I'm trying to think of anything else that, uh... Or, uh, what did I say? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, I don't know, man. It's, that's, a, that's a hard one to go on. Yeah, what the hell else? Uh, the twins? It's people. No, dude, it's on the Twin Cities. Oh, Nuggets. Gold. Yeah. 49ers. <laughs> Those are no, gold miners. People, people. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, dude, I don't know. The okay, Lakers? Because so it was the Minneapolis Lakers, and they moved to L.A. where there's no lakes, but they kept the Lakers. Why were they the Lakers? Then? Because they were in Minneapolis. The Minneapolis Lakers, a land of a thousand lakes. Then they moved oh. to Los Angeles, and they didn't change the team. I did not know this about Indiana. Indianapolis. Minneapolis. I didn't Minnesota. know. I didn't know. I don't know the history. All right, sir. Just explain. Yeah, it Minneap Minnesota more is the land of a th me. ten thousand lakes. Yes. So it was the Minneapolis Lakers because they were originally in Minnesota. Dude. Then they moved to Los Angeles, where there are no lakes, but they kept the Lakers name. Why is it called the land of a thousand lakes? Because there's like tons of lakes in Minnesota. <laughs> Shut ten, up! Is this a real it's, thing? It's, yes. Ten, their license plate says "Land of Ten Thousand Lakes." I've never seen a. What the hell would I see a Minneapolis license the, plate? I have one in the bedroom. I'm not. Well, so what are you trying to tell the people then? I'm always in your bedroom now. <laughs> is that what you want them to think? Exactly. I've been in there like twice. Yeah, dude. You usually bring me baconators, <laughs> which I appreciate. And I don't even look in there, dude, because I want you. You just have your, your junk hanging around, or your yeah. Lakers, my license plate. Yeah, what else? Uh, no, is this a real thing? So we really, really is, have yeah. a thousand, thousands. Of 10, oh yeah, dude. That's, there's lakes all over the place. Yeah, that's crazy. I know, like, uh, I mean, they're not like Lake Erie. They're like little lakes. Yeah, but, yeah, I get you. Like, I know Canada is like notorious for that. Like, you you wouldn't even believe how many lakes. I think it's like the most dense or the most well, I think lake that's populated from, uh, area. The Ice Age, because there was all the glaciers that yeah. came in and like. But why Minneapolis? It's not up there in Canada. Yes. That's weird. It's right next to Canada. But it ain't in Canada. Maybe. Okay. All right. Fine. I don't know, Jonas. I don't know geography. I didn't know that was a thing. Thank you for the education. Yeah, dude, no problem. You're, you've been to Minneapolis. I've I lived assume. in Minnesota. Did you not know this? Are you serious? Yeah, dude. I lived in Minnesota for like a year. This That's where my mother lives. This explains so much. What do you mean? It explains so much, dude. My mom lives in Minnesota. You're part Minnesotan. Yeah, dude. I've been here for a year. My mom's been 20 years in Minnesota. Dad, you know what? She's one third Minnesotan. She, yeah, dude. And then you being from her loins. Yeah, dude. You're part Minnesotan. No wonder. Why didn't you tell me this before? Why don't you tell me your Why lineage? Why don't you know about my life? Why don't you tell me your <laughs> lineage, Jodas? My li <laughs> exactly. I don't know anything about my lineage. Yeah, me as far as I know, like everybody I know is from Cleveland. I'm like 100% Cleveland. Yeah. And probably like part Ben Franklin or some shit. Part Ben Franklin. <laughs> I, I didn't realize that was a race. Bill. People, <laughs> I'm part Ben Franklin. Well, the way Ben Franklin was getting down with, with our people, Jonas. Whoa, dude. <laughs> um, it but let's see. Any other teams? The 76ers, dude. The 76ers. That's a group of people, dude. Because that's like, isn't it? I don't know. I don't know. What's dude, a 76er? Right. Exactly. It's just. A, oh, I like how he played hot potato with that ball. <laughs> um, I don't know, dude. Yeah, dude. The Brewers. No, because that's brewers, people brewing. You see? People, dude, you're going to. It's always yeah, like the, What do the, you want? You want the, the Cleveland pots? Cleveland <laughs> potholes? <laughs> yeah, I don't know. The Cleveland cooking utensils? See, I like, I would just like them to be a little bit more, you know, proactive well, with they, the names. I like names that are adjectives. Dude, or not adjectives, but like verbs. They used to be the, uh, what the hell just happened? They used to be the Washington Bullets. 
in basketball. Yes, I remember that. That was not a person or a mystical creature. It was not. And see, I kind of like that. I well, like me too. Just... Then they like promoted violence and stuff. But it was like, me. come on, it was a different time. I don't really understand how bullets <laughs> make you think because they never. Really, really... I never like associated it. Like I never. That. Yeah, I, they never had like a gun icon shooting bullets, Washington. Or... Yeah, dude. Uh, I like the Supersonics a lot. I like that. Um, I like names like The Power or like The Punch. Oh, or yeah, like, yeah, dude. The like, Cleveland Surge, bro. No, it wasn't Cleveland, but. Like, uh, you have, when I think about, like, esports, they're really good. Like, some of the Overwatch teams are, like, the Shock, the, uh. Yeah. The, <laughs> the Excelsior or the XL. Oh, nice. See, I like There was a team, a minor league <laughs> basketball team in Erie when I was a kid. It was called the Erie Wave. I like and that. And their logo was like a giant wave. I like that. Remember the Cleveland Crunch? Yeah, dude. I like that. See, there used to be the Youngstown Pride basketball team way back in the day. That's very close. That's animals, I feel. But I get it. It's it's a double entendre. It could be a pride. I'm thinking pride of lions. Uh, and yeah, is that yeah. what you I think, mean? I think their logo may have been a, a lion head. So, yeah, yeah, that's true. That's a good name, though. I like that because it is a double entendre. Yeah, dude, they're like, we're proud to be from Youngstown. <laughs> <laughs> Said no one ever. And oh, nobody ever. You can say that. I lived there for many years. Um, he had a pride loss tonight. Yeah. <laughs> I bet you. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Our pride. Yeah. It's like the Browns every time they play. Oh, God. Then if the pride ever moved, we lost the pride. Yep, we yep. lost our pride, dude. <laughs> we lost it long Story ago. Story my life, losing my effing pride. You um, lost it long ago. Yeah, dude. It's, it's, I wish they did, like, they should just be, like, uh, <laughs> the Cleveland Seniors. And it's just, like, an old man's their logo. I, I old lady like, and old man holding hands. Uh, yo. And then you just go out there and stomp them. Oh, <laughs> dude. Yeah, we, just, we just no, stomp the seniors. No, not stomp the seniors. I mean, the team gets out there and they just stomp the other, <laughs> the other team. So that you just see, like, their granny icon and they're just beating the other teams. Aw, dude, let's watch old people beat up te teams. I didn't want them to beat the old people out there. You want you want old people to play? What if they called them the act? What if they actually called them the old people? Like <laughs> the Seattle old people. <laughs> see, that's fine by me. Dude, I okay. love football teams. All right, Jonas, we're going to switch it up here. What team would win if all the teams could battle it out and it was equal? What team would win if you changed the team into the animal? Or the group of people, or the the name associated with. Um, I feel like the Lakers would win because everyone would drown. What is it? Like, we don't even know what a Laker is. It, it turns into nothing because a Laker is not a thing, so it loses automatically. Oh, it can't be a lake. Yeah, you can't. Oh, you turn into a Steeler. Congratulations, you lost because there is no Steeler. Uh, you turn into a Brown. Congratulations, you lost. But we're used to it because a Brown isn't a thing. You turn into the color Brown, you lose. Okay, but I feel you. If okay. I'm a Diamondback, yo, I'm already. What is that? I'm. The Diamondbacks. You lose? No, you're up there. What you're on the board. Is, what is a Diamondback? It's a snake. <laughs> oh, I see what you mean. It's yeah. a snake. So you make the board. You're a snake. So now you got to think of what would be the most Cardinals. Does a Cardinal beat a Diamondback? No, dude. So the Diamondback moves up in the ranks. No. What can defeat the Diamondback? <laughs> What can beat the Diamondback? I'm making a snake motion. I know you are, dude. It's, it, it's All very right. Beat. So can a ram, can a ram beat a Diamondback? I mean, essentially it could. Okay. Ram moves up. Diamondback has been defeated. <laughs> Who are we playing right now? Cardinals already lost. Yeah, Bruin. Oh! <laughs> oh, shit. <laughs> you just said the S word. I'm sorry. How you got passion swears on <laughs> So, so Bengals is at the top of the heap as far as I'm concerned. Yeah, what, what else about, do we have? What about the Tigers? The Indians. Oh, Tigers versus Bengal Tiger versus regular Tiger. I think Bengals are bigger, Jonas. Yeah, dude. I'm making I like a head-to-head -head collision. The Bengals are going to take. So can the Indians beat a Tiger? Yes. Uh, I would have to say so. What do you think? Indians versus... I mean, an entire race of people? Yeah. I mean, I think it's... if you take an entire race of people, they'll beat them. <laughs> <laughs> no, it just turns into, like, a, a tribe. But I still think, like, a, a group of Indians, <laughs> a group of indigenous people could take... Ew, they got to change that name. Could take out the Tigers. So we, the Tiger moves ahead. Yeah. Washington football team versus the Cleveland indigenous people. I don't know. The dude. entire Washington football team trained versus professional... an entire race? 
Well, it's just a, it's just a tribe. You didn't, you're not gonna get all the other people. Oh, you don't get yeah. all. You don't get. Or like in yes. like in a football. No, not in a football team. Now I just mean like they're fighting against each other because now they've transformed into these these entities and they're they're jockeying for a position of world domination. Dude, jockeying is great. I think a football team could take out a group of people. Oh my God. <laughs> Jesus, dude. Let's just move the football team up, all right? Let's just move them up. We will get off of that subject. Football team wins. <laughs> That's it. We win, dude. The no, dude, because there's dude. a team called the Dragons out there that we have. There's Mighty Ducks. Have you ever seen a Mighty Duck win? Other than in the effing movie. <laughs> It probably beat like the Diamondbacks. I don't know, maybe. Dude. It's a very That's strong a duck is gonna f- diamond back up. I don't know, dude. <laughs> is is the Diamondback poisonous? Because uh, if it's yes. poisonous, then it wins. Just one strike, dude. No, it's because over. the snake could still. I mean, the duck could still kill the snake, and it's kind of like a tie. Then both of them would get removed. I don't know. What is the most powerful football team? Put the or most powerful team if it were transformed into its team name? Oh, Put there's a the ladder, com- dude. Look. Yeah, the ladder's back. Put in the How comments. How do you ha- not take that effing glitch out, Jonas, dude? See, we, we complained about it every week. I don't know. <laughs> every it's been day. A, it's been a few weeks, dude. There, come, there comes a time where you're just like, eh. Yeah, put your favorite team in the thing that would win all the stuff, dude. Yeah, the strongest team name. All right. That's all the time we have for today's episode. Please make sure to like and subscribe. If you've already done that, this dude does Twitch stuff. TNT Dynamite. I'm on... Bulldogs would not win. TNT Dynamite. I'm on Twitch every single day at 10 o'clock a.m. Central. TNT D-I-N-O-M-I-G-H-T underscore crazy town. Twitch.tv. Uh, for Jonas. Catch you on the next one. We uh, are out. Uh,